Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Pamela and I make content on all different things, including horticulture, hair, bags, and my life. So if you're interested, don't forget to subscribe. And the bus gotta go, so I'm gonna take a sip of coffee. But on today's video, I am doing a what's in my bag. And it has to do with what's inside of here. Yes, OMG. I went out the other day and I picked up so many awesome goodies from the drugstore and from the dollar store. So if you're interested in seeing what I have in this handbag, huge stuffed, then keep on watching. <laughs> pulled out a table in front of me. I'm gonna move my coffee so it doesn't <coughs> spill. And I had some mangoes I cut that I, so sweet, so soft and delicious. All right. I don't know if you guys are like me, but I love a what's in my bag. And two things. Firstly, I live in New York and on March 1st, as of March 1st, plastic bags are banned. No more plastic bags. We've been so spoiled for so many years, but now you gotta bring your own, you know, like recyclable, whatever, your own bag. And I completely forgot, but thank goodness when I went out, I went out with this bag. And the second thing is, this is actually my grandma's bag, so it's amazing to have something from her, a vintage um, masterpiece that is has come in so handy. But I'm going to insert the clips in where I had to go to the post office and once I left the post office I'm like, you know what, let me try to see what I can find from both the Dollar Tree. Um, or is it Family Dollar, one of those stores, and the uh, pharmacy. And I think I went to Rite Aid specifically um, because there's one of the people I follow on Instagram, she posted something about an amazing pot, and I'm like, ooh, I've been on a hunt for pots for my plants, so let me check those out because they were 50% off. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. to look at what can I pick up um for some fancy tea high wise let's see okay so I found these I'm gonna check the I'm gonna check another aisle probably if I find anything else, I like that they have these like nursery pots, cute and smaller terracotta ones. I love the small terracotta pots. What else do they have? Hmm. I don't know. Do I want to? I think I might do a small clay pot. I think I need one. I'm gonna take that. Alright, so I'm gonna go on the line and pay. Oh, oh my gosh, there's so much for me to look at. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, guys. Alright, I'm gonna have a look here to see everything is 50% off. And thank you, social media, for letting your girl know. 
social media peeps everything is half off for example if you like something like this this is $7.99 which is $8.00 so this be four bucks oh my gosh I'm going to have the best time inside of the store I'm definitely getting this for sure four bucks yes yes for sure all right I'm gonna go get a card and I'm gonna shop and I'll see you guys back at home so I'm gonna start off with showing you guys what's in this bag Ugh. all right the first thing I'm gonna pull out in my Mary Poppins bag of course the beauty this beauty oh my god I cannot, I don't even know what plant to put inside of this pot. Uh, I'm not too sure of the measurements. I think it, uh, it's a five inch pot, five and a half inch pot. So this is number one. So the second pottery that I picked up from Rite Aid is this one, this blue one. This is really cute. This is lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. And as you can see, the pattern. So, I'm gonna transplant that. And this one, I believe, was $3.99, which is a really awesome price. So, total, I paid $9.78. It's under $10 for two beautiful plant pots. So I also, like I mentioned, decided to go to either the Dollar Tree or Family Dollars. I can never remember which is which. And I wanted to see what I could find in there that are planty related that are for a discounted price because why go to a Home Depot and spend, you know, X amount of dollars when I can find double for Y amount of dollars. Alright, so I pulled out this whole entire basket. Not planting related. I got some airheads. Sometimes you want something sweet and we don't really keep candy in my house, so I had to sneak that in. Next is some sour patches. I got these twist tie and the twist tie cutter and it came with an extra one. I love these for so many different things in the house, so I'm happy to have this. Um, also, I've been wanting to make a totem pole, so I decided to get these two coconut baskets. I'll DIY cut it onto my stick with the sagna moss, and I'll see how that goes. So I picked these up. Also, furthermore, in this bag, I found a set of two clay pots for a dollar, which is really great. Um, I don't know what size these are. These don't have a size, but I'm assuming like a two, two and a half inch potter. I found these little mini one inch pots too. It's a set of three. I use these a lot in my house actually, so I wanted to just have a few extra in my collection. I will officially turn to the... I've always been that person, but I have more pots than I do plants because you never know. You never know. You never know. So, so this is the last thing that I was able to pick up from the 99 cent store. And this is a turtle. Little turtle planter and I guess its name is Tilly. This is cute. It's cute. So this I might gift with a plant to someone. Because you know, why not? Why not? You know what I mean? 
And guys, that's pretty much all that I was able to fit inside of this bag. Um, thank you, Granny, for the bag, of course. And <sighs> no more plastic in New York. I was able to find so many awesome things at the dollar store. So check those out. And also check out your local Rite Aid, Walgreens, CVS, Tweed Read, so on and so forth. Because you can find amazing deals and things just go on half off. So always keep an eye out for those guys. But thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you aren't already. Join this little cookie family because we're pretty awesome here. And I'll see you on the next one. Let's get growing.